There is some good news, though, for students at public schools across the county. Free at-home COVID tests are on the way. Yeah, we expected them by now. The County Office of Education says it received nearly 200,000 tests from the state last night, and today those test kits are being distributed. News HD Price joins us live now from Redwood Village in the Mid-City area outside of a school that just picked up the test. Steve, we've been talking about it for a couple days. I bet they are so glad to have those test kits in hand. They are definitely glad, Marcella and Carl. Yeah, this is Darnall Charter School. It is one of 22 school districts and charter schools around our county that did receive those take-home COVID tests for students. Now, unfortunately, they did not receive those tests in time for students to take a test before returning to class. But I talked to officials here, and they say, hey, better late than never. Well, we're very, very excited. I think, you know, this is going to go a, a long way in, you know, helping us, um, you know, helping out our community and ensuring that all staff members are safe as well as, as, well as our students. So this is going to go a, a long way. We're very, very excited to get these um, COVID tests. The San Diego County Office of Education thought they were getting 400,000 test kits, enough for every public school student that didn't, didn't already get one but they only received 193,000. So they handed them out on a first come first serve basis among the districts getting tests today. Poway, San Ysidro, Escondido Union. The County Office of Education says they didn't find out until the last minute that they were gonna be short on the number of tests received. So as you can imagine, they are frustrated. School districts are frustrated and parents are frustrated. On the one hand, these kits are great because that's 193,000 families that are going to have access to them. On the other hand, we're cognizant of the fact that that's not all of our families. So we're waiting on another shipment from the state. As soon as we get it, we'll do the same process where we notify school districts and charter schools. They can come pick them up and distribute them to families. So late this afternoon, I was on a conference call with state health officials and they said that they are going to be sending out more of these home test kits this week, but they didn't offer any specifics. So we don't know if and when San Diego will be getting them. One other note to pass along, Marcel and Carlo. Unfortunately, we saw a lot of parents that headed down to the County Office of Education's warehouse today to try and pick up those tests. They are not handing them out individually to parents. Instead, they're giving them to the districts, then letting the schools hand them out. So parents do not go to that warehouse hoping you'll get a test. I know parents uh, are really concerned. A lot of people want those tests. We just heard that San Diego State is moving to online learning. Any talk about uh, our local schools moving to online learning for those districts that don't have those tests in hand yet? So, Marcelo, the one thing state officials said is that they want to do everything they can to keep these schools open. So they said the only way that they're going to close these schools is if, number one, so many teachers have COVID that they have a staffing shortage. They can't get substitutes in. The other concern is if there is a COVID outbreak actually on the campus. Those are really the only two ways they would shut down a campus. Just because students didn't have a chance to test before coming back, they say that is not a reason to shut down a school. Yeah, unfortunately, it looks like those scenarios are very possible in this current wave. We've got to hope they don't happen and the schools can stay open. It's a big deal for the kids and their families. Yeah. Steve Price reporting live. Thanks, Steve. Yeah.